Hello, shining ones. Oh, do I have a message for you today. If you think astrology is boring, you will never think that again. We're going to talk about the Sagittarius full moon. Uh, but I got to show you something. I'm saving for the end. Look, look at this picture. Can you see this here? Yeah, that's Magus kissing <laughs> another man. That's right. This Megas channel will never be canceled. That's some man-on-man -man lip action. And my friends, I, you won't believe this story. I'm going to save that to the very end because I want you to stay and, and hear uh, about the power of this full moon. But, but this story, my friends, it, it has sex. It has adultery. It has violence. It has Megas being sprayed with bear spray. My friends, it has it all. It has prophecy. It has magic. It has healing. But most of all, it has forgiveness in it and love. My friends, oh, do I have, I got chills as I'm talking about, even wore my white Asha hoodie because, you know, I'm telling this story. And of course, I, I, I'm the angel of the story, my friends. So, so on the third, we have the Sagittarius full moon. You, you know, Sagittarius, we all know it's the greatest sign. I, I might be a little partial because it's my sign, uh, but it's about aiming higher, right? And I love it. It goes perfect with Zoroastrian astrology. Zoroastrians say you must teach your children three things, to ride a horse, archery, and to tell the truth. My God, that sounds like Sagittarius, right? It's the horse. It's the archer. It's aiming high. It's telling the truth. I brought a bow out. Just so you'll have a visual here, my friends. Uh, the, the bow, it, it, the bow, it, it makes a frequency. It makes a sound. My friends, it's string theory. Everything is energy and vibration. And we manifest w w with a frequency. And our frequency is truth. And we have our arrows. And we want to aim high. We want to aim to the highest truth. The highest good. The perfect creator's perfect idea that we call Asha. If you have one of those gods that get jealous, angry, hate, war, kill men, women, and children. Stone your children. Stone the woman caught in adultery. Bloody sacrifices. You might not be aiming your arrow as high as you can you are not telling the truth my friends the truth is only a perfect thought can come from a perfect creator and it's good it's not mixed my friends my god my god the full moon you, you, you know the full moon it, it can rise tides but it also rises what's inside of you if it's good or evil my friends it's gonna manifest what are you holding inside of you what is your energy what are your beliefs the programming in your subconscious mind that you have are, are gonna be brought to manifest you know we say it all the time carl Jung said what's hidden in your subconscious will be manifest you can know your future you got to take that light of the full moon and let it shine inside those shadow areas where do you need to be healed and that's what i want to talk about the healing we have a sex style to chiron from the sun trying to the moon and this is about a time to heal past traumas and that brings me back to this sexy picture right there look at that Look at that smooching. Look at that bearded magus smooching that man right there. That man right there is the guy that slept with my wife. Broke up my family. Only got to see my kids on the weekends. That man right there, we went to blows. I punched that stupid face of his so many times. He sprayed me with bear spray. You know, that stuff, it's meant to shut down your respiratory. It's meant to blind you so all you can do is just lay there and try to survive. It did something opposite in me, my friends, because he was cheating, sleeping with my wife, breaking up my family. And then he had the nerve to spray me with bear spray. I went insane on him, my friends. And it made me think, I don't think I ever want to use bear spray. It didn't seem to work. My, my friends, and I hated him. But do you know what? Uh, the police got involved because we wouldn't stop. It's not in me to quit. I wanted to save my family, my friends. And I knew I was in the right. I knew he was wrong. 
But do you know what? Violence wouldn't fix it, I discovered. And so finally, uh, I, you know, I have a prophetic gift. And when something leaves my mouth, it happens every time. I've seen it. I could tell you story after story. Our song, Asha, is. That's one of my favorite. I, I knew we needed music on our channel here. And I decreed and declared it just bubbled up out of me. Tomorrow, I, I'm alone when I'm saying this. Tomorrow, someone will run up to me and say, I have someone to make a song for you. My friends, the next day, I, I was out for a walk. A man ran up to me and, and showing me a, uh, his phone and saying, check this out. He, had, he was emotional. And he's all, this is my daughter. She started writing music and singing. And she's got all these views. And he was so moved. I started crying. Because I just the other day, yesterday, the day before, decreed and declared it. And there it was. I've seen this time and time again, my friends. And you know what? I, I told him, back to the, the guy sleeping with my wife. I said, I will never lay another hand on you. I, I said, but you will begin to die from this point on. You will deteriorate from this time on. My friend, I kid you not, the next time I saw him, I went to pick up my kids the next week. He, he was kind of hunched over, not looking so good, a little peaked. Next time I went over to pick up my kids, he, he, he wasn't getting out of bed. Pretty soon he was completely deteriorating. My friend, he was dying. It, come to find out he, he had Parkinson's and a bunch of other crap. He was all shaky, you know, and, and I, I started to feel bad, it, you know, because my divine spark, even though I, I was, I hated him. I hated him. My, my friends, but at the same time, I loved him. Isn't that a confusing thing? My friends, I loved him and I started to get emotional and I started thinking, I don't want him to die. I want him to live. And do you know what I did? I, I started speaking Asha and truth into him. I, I went and I got him this book, The Healing Code, and we went through it together and about focusing on the health and not the disease. And he started going to every kind of possible treatment you, you could give, but it wasn't looking very positive. But do you know what? Today, he is completely healed. And guess what? People don't get healed from Parkinson's. As a matter of fact, I just watched what was Michael J. Fox on Netflix. It, it, it deteriorates, my friends, just like I prophesied over him, my friends. But I, I had a change of heart. I, I, I said, God, I, I don't know why, but I want him to live, my friends. And it, it came from my heart. Oh, I wanted to forgive. I don't want to live in hate anymore my friends and then he had a beautiful daughter and i fell in love with her my friends pretty soon i'm babysitting their child <laughs> and she's my daughter now too and you know what he, he got so sick for a time he he couldn't go out and do things with her so so i would take them out together I would take him to the pool and he couldn't even unbutton his clothes to get into his bathing suit. I had to dress him. I had to unbutton his clothes, put on his shorts, help him into the pool, throw his daughter up in the air for him so he could feel like he's getting splashed and playing too. My friends, it doesn't pay to hold hate. It doesn't pay to hurt each other. We need to love each other because inside of us, we have that divine spark. See the God in others. My friends, love others. It's time to make some changes. It's time to forgive. It's time to let that light come in and heal those shadow places. Let the love of God flow over you and through you and in you and watch it heal. And pretty soon you're going to have pictures smooching your enemies my friends guys i love you so much let's use this time to heal to heal ourselves to heal our families to heal our world as we hold these higher frequencies these higher ideas we aim higher we don't want those gods anymore they, they get angry jealous hate war kill we we don't want that unforgiveness anymore we want pure love we want kindness we want goodness and we will fight for that 
my friends, and we're going to fight with, with our love and our peace, and I'm going to be it. I'm not going to let anyone steal it from me. You will not steal my peace. You will not steal my joy. I create my atmosphere. And today I choose love. I choose Asha. I choose the highest truth. Asha is. Asha is. Asha is. I love you guys.